John, attorney Kayla Griffin is a young woman who is passionate about creating policies that produce positive change. As a new president of the Cleveland branch of the NAACP, she hopes to do just that and in the process, make Cleveland a better land. Little girl Kayla was talkative, an idealist, always in trouble, definitely a troublemaker. I was a natural born leader, but I was very curious. As a little girl, Kayla Griffin knew she had the qualities that would prepare her for the role she walks in today. I've always wanted to protect others. Her time on the high school basketball court set her up for a future in the court of law. My father was my basketball coach. He trained me just as hard at home as he did on the court. We had a very strict home when it came to discipline. And it's something she passed down to her younger siblings. Rules and discipline is not for your um, detriment. It is truly for your benefit. And you'll understand it, as all folks say, you'll understand it better by, by and by. by. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. After she graduated from Cleveland State University, she got a job in the recreation department with the city of Cleveland. And that's when she noticed. There was still something significantly lacking when it came to the policy and how we addressed issues in our communities. So she got involved with the NAACP. When you understand that you're connected to something bigger and greater than you and you understand the legacy, and the resources that they have that we can plug into, it really reshapes and reframes how you do the work. I was there the night that Judge Nelson, he swore you in as the new president. Uh, as I was wondering then, and I'm wondering now, what is going through your mind in that moment? There's definitely a weight and a responsibility that comes with the position. I understood the responsibility. I have been a part of this organization and worked and served in different capacity. I've learned from the best. I've sat under the best. And so I'm capable and I'm able to do this. On the top of her to-do list, vote, 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 yeah. vote. Voting and civic engagement is one of the game changers, um, as we call it, within the NAACP. It's already her day job. I work as a voting rights specialist, right? I'm the state director for an organization called All Voting is Local. We're on the precipice of like a shift in our regime where we can really see democracy crumble or we could see our country stand up to the values and the ideas that it was founded on. Cleveland has one of the lowest voting rates in the state and Griffin says voting is the front door to democracy. So getting people to vote is her main focus. The Kayla I'm looking at right now, what would you say to little girl Kayla? What advice would you give her? I would just say continue to be curious and don't be afraid to ask questions. You cannot be intimidated by um, the bigness of you know answers. Be curious and um, be ready for what comes. I think she's definitely ready for what comes. And what I loved about talking to Kayla is she's a young woman. Uh, she got into trouble uh, as a little girl, but remember what the late Congressman John Lewis said, you gotta be ready to get into some good trouble. Kayla is ready to get into some good trouble. Positive, powerful yeah. force that she gives off. Oh, it yeah. was amazing. And that always makes me feel good. So we wish her the best in this new role. She is the youngest president, by the way, of the Cleveland brand. So.